Hi everybody, this is Jill with Greenwood Girl Cards, and I'm just coming on um, to show you this little Christmas tree that I made. And I don't know if the lighting is better with that off. Maybe I'll try it with it off. But um, I, you guys might remember a, a few years ago, I made this little tree, and it's just some ribbon tied onto a paper straw. And then I added a, a star and some buttons and a tag that says Warm Winter Wishes. And I had shown this on my YouTube channel a couple years back. I think it's been two years. It might be longer. Time has a funny way of going by. But anyway, I had wanted to send these out to make these and send them out as gifts to people. And I, I actually have several of them started, but I have never had time to finish them. And uh Anyway, um, a friend of mine is going to have surgery, and she is one of the people that I have always wanted to send one of these to. And um, I, the only thing I don't like about this is this gets knocked over fairly easily. So I was trying to find a better way um, to stand these up, like a bigger spool or something. And it's hard to find things, but I finally found at the thrift store this cute little white mug and it's I think it's like a, an, a demi toss or an espresso um, size cup because it's it's really not much bigger than that so <laughs> um, it's about two inches three inches tall maybe um, so anyway I had already made this tree for her but I had never finished it and I really wanted to get it to her um, because she's going to have surgery. So I thought I would just come on and just share it with you guys. And uh, in here, inside the cup to cover the foam that I have holding the straw, I used a product that's on sale at Hobby Lobby this week. And it's rolls of cheesecloth like this. So this is over where they sell the tool. And so I purchased a roll of that. And it's, again, if you really like it, you can go get it. It's 50% off this week. And, um, that's what I have covering the foam in here. And then you might remember these little um, deer. And these were something that I found on Etsy a number of years back when Paper Tray Ink used them in a kit. And so if you just look for little deer cabochons on Etsy, they should come up. Um, either Etsy or eBay, they both have them. Um, anyway, and then there's a little butterfly pin in here. And then I just put on three buttons with some twine and a little tag that's a pink polka dot that says warm winter wishes and the fabrics are mostly vintage fabrics that I collected over the years and and then I added a little bit of the um, the yarn the eyelash trim yarn and this is actually a pink uh, sparkle one that I got from a Martha Stewart's line <laughs> years ago years and years ago so it's been in my stash for a long time and then this star at the top is just a, a glass um, glittered star that I got from a company that no longer exists. So um, anyway, uh, I'm going to send this off to her and I, I just thought I would share it with you. This is just a little tag with a note that she can take off and, um, and it stands up on its own and it's really sturdy, which is what I liked about putting it in the cup. So um, I'm hoping I can find a few more of these little white uh, you know, type mugs or something similar so I can finish making trees for people and maybe get them out um, to them. But, uh, it just, you know, I get to things as I can get to them. And I, I really made time today to do this specifically because I want to do something special for this person. So um, this is the card that I made her and it just says blessings to you. And this is an old reindeer dye. Um, a deer dye it's called and it's from a basic gray line from many years ago and I've used this before and shown you guys and uh, this is just a little tiny piece of this old vintage trim that looks like this and I just cut a piece of the trim to use to make it look like she has a collar on so um, and then this is just some vellum and a little bit of um, glitter glue to make the deer sparkle in places so this is the card I'm going to send with the tree. And that's all I have to share with you guys today, other than I did get a new stamp set in the mail. And I'll show you the image. This is the image. I just shared it on my Instagram, which is Greenwood Girl, G-R-E-E-N-W-D-G-I-R-L. And if you go there and um, 
look me up you should be able to to see if you know if you join my feed uh, you'd be able to see the link to where this came from but I just Christina Betts shared this on her Instagram and maybe on her channel too I think and I just fell in love with this image so I had to order the stamp set and this is what the whole stamp set looks like and uh, so the girls there, I think I don't have her lined up in the packaging quite right, so she looks a little blurry, but it says winter time. It has this little cinnamon winter latte and then some snowflakes and then baby it's cold outside as well as a border. So I'm going to finish uh, adding some more detail to this probably and uh, I think I'm going to make like a turquoise card with her. So that's coming along and then the only other thing I have to share is um, do you guys remember when Vicki um, I had shared a video using this embossing folder last year and then Vicki made some really cool cards um, I had done mine in red and green I think and she had done one where she actually did gingerbread color and I think she did her background in blue kind of like on this one but anyway I really liked what Vicki did so I just played around last weekend and I made a couple cards but this was all that I got done so um, I just haven't had a lot of time and to be honest I haven't I just don't have full energy so I just get to things as I get to them so anyway I hope you guys are all having a really good week um, it is Thursday the weekend is ahead of us and uh, I just send love to everybody um, the world is a hard place right now and uh, I just want I just want us all to spread love and joy, especially as the holidays approach. Thanksgiving is coming too, so if I don't come on and do another video before then, I wish you all a joyous Thanksgiving with your family and friends. Um, for those of you that are ill, I wish you speedy healing to Don and so many others, Susan, uh, just Lisa, many people that I know that are going through hard times, Sheila, if you're still out there. Um, you know, I, uh, I just wish everyone healing and recovery. And for those of you that are maybe missing loved ones, um, I pray that your heart is warmed by my words. So God bless us. Everybody have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And hopefully I'll be back maybe to share some tags before then. You never know. <laughs> Take good care. Bye now.